it's uh, Saturday, February 4th today, and um, I haven't hit golf balls all week because honestly, I haven't felt that great. So my back was a little tight one of the days. And I came home on it was Thursday, and it just felt like crap. So I haven't hit any golf balls recently except for some putting. So if that counts, that counts. But I'd rather hit some uh, hit some wedges and some irons and whatnot to get that going well. My putting has been decent, but um, I got to be able to do more than just putt the ball. So uh, that's one of the things I really want to be able to work on. For this upcoming year and I think what will help me score the best is with my my mid iron basically all my irons and my wedges um, what I've learned over the years is and people have different expect or different opinions on stuff like this but I personally think that I would rather have my my irons and my wedges going well than I would my driver any day of the week. So, um, and one year, basically, I had my driver all over the place, but my wedges and my irons were spot on. And then the following year, I had my iron or my driver down the center every time, but my irons were just crap. So, and I didn't score as well as I did with uh, the opposite. So, Hopefully, I'll be able to get both down this year. So, uh, once I get this down, then I can start setting up, start hitting the ball. And one of the big things that I wanted to, one of the big things I wanted to continue working on is is having a nice, smooth swing, as well as um, making sure that. I get that nice long arc on my back straight. That's really what I've seen. Is get that nice long arc on the back swing that's gotten me my most power. Uh, so I want to continue working on on that. So those are the two things I'm working on this week. Make sure that I have that long arch back swing and uh, making sure that's nice smooth uh, swing going forward. So. Um, hopefully uh, that helps other people out and I'll show you in the video here next what I'm uh, referring to. <laughs> Stretching my arms by pulling the 
golf club behind my body like so. Might be kind of hard for some. I'm pretty limber. So I like to do that just to get the whole body moving and making sure that I don't have any issues with injuries and stuff. I haven't had any golf injuries last year. Hopefully I won't have any this year either. So, so what I was referring to on that long, large, big arch is the feeling of stretching your body as far as you can out away from you. Get that nice arch and then going through gives you that nice big arch and, and uh, hopefully get some club head speed doing that as well. So hopefully that works for you guys. And uh, remembering to, as I've said in some of my first videos, go straight back with the club instead of coming on the inside like so. So, all right, line this ball up so my uh, Vector Pro will see it. Let's see what we can do for our first couple balls here. Start off a little to the right, but not bad. 141 total distance, so not too bad after from my first uh, couple swings. I had a draw to it, but I pushed it so much that it didn't come back like I wanted it to. Until next time.